friends welcome back to my channel it's Jennifer here today I am doing a little video showing you all my recent purchases last month I don't know what was up with me but I just I needed to buy everything like I was like rah, 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 rah. I'm a cheap frugal person but like there was some stuff that I was like this is necessary this is this is you need this so I'm going to show you what I got and do a little try on of some things and yay. We're going to start off with shoes. I got two pairs of shoes that are now like one of the, like these shoes are incredible. I cannot wait to show you. We're going to start with the gold first, the gold. Let me show you what I got from Converse first. Are you ready? thigh high converse i am deceased like literally i have been searching for these for the past few years on like ebay thrift stores flea markets and can never find them and i also didn't really want to buy used converse like some stinky like sneaker like i'll buy other used shoes but like sneakers i'm like Ugh. but i would have done it for these shoes when i was younger i wanted these but i didn't think that i would look good in them so i think that's why i never got them i don't know i i have no words for how excited i am about these shoes i'm gonna try them on right now and show you just how incredible they look on because they are so good ah! these shoes are you kidding me incredible incredible they said they um ran a little large which they kind of do i could have done a half size smaller but i didn't want to do the whole return process and now they're actually sold out everywhere like there's some bigger sizes but like my size is sold out so i'll just be keeping these p.s i bought everything myself in this haul nothing is like um pr or anything okay so yay Time to show you the next shoes. <laughs> so this next pair of shoes I've been wanting for like almost a year. I feel like this shoe has been out for a long time, but I just never got them because I have a pair of shoes that are like pretty, pretty identical, similar to these, but they've recently started to like break and like, cause I wear them a lot for work and stuff. So I was like, I need a replacement. So got these, are you ready? Do I love sick? No. They are these ah, pointed flat black patent leather buckle look. This is incredible. This is beyond incredible. But yeah, they had a good sale. I think I got these for like, I don't even know. Beautiful. Like I have no words. These are just like the most Jennifer shoe ever. Perfection perfection so i always use like discount codes when i order stuff online because duh and i had one code where i had to spend like literally 50 cents more so i bought like one of the cheapest things on the site um steve madden and so i just got these little cute little socks with these bows on them i was like yes i saved like i think like 20 bucks on these shoes next thing is something i ordered off of depop and it was something I had liked, like I feel like a year ago, and I got a notification that the seller lowered the price to thirteen dollars plus shipping. Um, beautiful, this cute little Betsy Johnson Betsyville purse. Love this print. I have like a big bag that's like the same one. Peg still on, marked for sixty-eight. Adorbs, just a cute little shoulder bag the straps are kind of wonky right now but that's okay but like it's perfect for concerts because i always want you to have like little purses so and the lightning bolt literally beautiful beautiful one of my favorite depop purchases ever Yee! next is something i got thrifting i haven't been that like thrifty lately but I found this one thing. It's this cute little long velvet skirt with little roses all over it. I was like, Argh! the tag is from Loft. I need to cut these things. But um, yeah, just like 
a nice cute little skirt. I think it was like $16. I sold stuff, so it was free. Let's try her on. Cute, just like simple. Yeah, I'm a fan. Next, I got a couple things from Target. I saw they were having like a swimsuit sale and I got like my favorite swimsuit ever last year from Target. Like they make some bomb swimsuits. So I saw this cute one, um, it was like $24 and I was like, I need it. Um, just like very practical one piece. I have a striped a one piece also, but like it has so much side boob and like crotch up and like butt. I was like, I wanna be covered. So this is like perfect for me. Like I don't like my butt hanging out in swimsuits and stuff. I don't know. I just like to be like, Wr. and then I saw this cute little sweater they had. Um, it's just like basic, but it's really sheer so it's like really thin like perfect for summer so i could like wear this over a dress and be like covered from the sun because i'm not trying to get any color i want to be pale forever okay i got a size large let's see the reviews were like it snags really easily so i hand washed it and i'm like trying to be really nice with it so my nails don't like snag on it Ugh. nice right Target has some good stuff sometimes. Next, I actually just got this yesterday. My husband played a show at the Whiskey A Go Go last week. He's in a Slipknot tribute band. They're amazing, not sick, look them up. Um, so they paid to get the set film. So we went to go pick up the footage and I forgot to get this hoodie last week cause I wanted it forever. I got this little Whiskey A Go Go hoodie or a zip up hoodie. This is in the front, oh, where is it? So cute, I was like, I need to represent the Sunset Strip. So, got this cute hoodie. So I got this in a 2XL and like I was like, huh? I was like, yeah, I like them oversized. Like who wears hoodies in their actual size? Not me. Um, so yeah, cute, and then the back. Amazing. Yay. Okay, just a couple more things. Next, I'm going to show you just a couple things I ordered from Amazon. I got these little skull patches because I'm making like these shorts or jeans. I haven't decided yet. Um, putting a bunch of patches on the butt. That will be, it's been on my to-do list for a while, but now I finally have the missing piece because I needed one more skull to complete my artistic direction. So, woohoo got these and then i got the cutest socks ever i needed some like white socks for like to go with my loafers and stuff came in a pack of three look how cute this little latisse edge so cute i'm obsessed so yay last up is my thrift store books and dvds slash video games so first up Coyote Ugly, this movie was like my childhood. I would go to my aunts all the time and babysit my cousins and I would put this on pretty much every single time I watched them. Next, I got Aladdin, the live action one. This is one of my husband's favorite Disney movies. So I was like, let me get this. And it was actually sealed. I wrapped up already, like it was brand new. So um, amazing. I always like Lysol and disinfect all my DVDs and books. So I just like ripped off the packaging, but um, a steal. But I don't like these prices, $3. Oh my God. How long have I had lipstick on my teeth? Hopefully not a long time, oh my God, ew. But yeah, I don't like this $3 price, but I did it for these because yeah. Next, I got a video game for my PS2, Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. I am so excited to play this um who wants to come over and play because it's going to be so much fun um yeah ps2 is the only gaming console i have because i like to play dance dance revolution but i haven't played that in a long time because like i live in an apartment and it probably annoys everybody because i'm like jumping around like a psychopath but um yay 
So I'm addicted to buying used books. I literally like have a problem every time I go to the thrift store, I just buy all of them. Not all of them, just like certain ones. So I got some new books. I literally have like probably 150 books I have not read in my bookshelves yet. So like I have this one and then more over there. Yeah, but um, anyways. I got gold. My favorite is getting books that have like a TV show or movie to go along with it. So um, I found three ones that I've never seen the show. So I got The Flight Attendant, um, the, White Queen, the White Queen, never even heard of this, but it looks fun. And then The Witcher. So I'm excited to read these and then watch the TV show. Woohoo. And then I got a couple other books. I got The Tale of Two Cities by Charles Dickinson because I'm trying to be smart and studious and read all the classics, so I got this. Next, I got All the Missing Girls. I love mystery thrillers and stuff. Um, this one's Our Missing Heart. Um, it looks kind of whatever, but um, I like Little Fires Everywhere, and it also has Reese's Book Club on there, and I read a book of that had that recently and it was incredible. So I was like, okay, I trust you Reese Witherspoon. I'll read your books. And then, and then the last book is If I Disappear. This looked just cool and the cover is really cool too. That is the end of this video. Hope it was marvelous, wonderful, everything. I will see you next time on my channel. Bye.